Nearly 1,500 El Pasoans have lost their lives to COVID-19, leaving families mourning and bearing the cost of funeral expenses. Well, one local nonprofit has stepped in to help families pay for the funerals, but now face losing CARES Act funding themselves. ABC 7's Jason Navarrete gives us a look at what the nonprofit is doing to continue to provide care for families in need. As 2021 begins, the need for help is just as great. Angel Gomez with Operation Hope tells me they remain committed to providing grieving families assistance, even as their CARES Act funding runs out. The need is, is growing every day. We get calls 1.45 in the morning, 3 in the morning, 8 in the morning. All hours of the day, people are passing away. Angel Gomez and Operation Hope have been helping families cover funeral expenses due to COVID-19 for months. FEMA helped Operation Hope with more than $25,000 over the past month, but that funding is now drying up. Gomez tells me his organization has helped at least 700 families. Believe me, when you hear these people crying on the phone, and they don't have any means, you know, and... And knowing that you can help in a little way, you got to do something. Operation Hope will now be providing grieving families $1,000 towards funeral expenses. And through a partnership with Perches Funeral Homes, Perches has offered Operation Hope a reduced price for services. A lot of people have lost their jobs and it's very hard times because sometimes they can't have what they want because of uh, you can't have a, a big viewing or a mass or a lot of things. But uh, we will always be here for our city, and, um, and, and we're here to help. Betches tells me the influx of COVID-19-related deaths is a spike no one was prepared for. I've never gone through something like this. You know, we went through some hard times in Juarez, through the violent times that it, from 08 to 12. But with this, it has been overwhelming. We have to take care of, of the deceased, and it's been very, very difficult to keep up with everything. We are taking care of everyone at, uh, you know, at the end when they need us. If you'd like more information on how you can help Operation Hope, we have information on their Facebook page on this story on our website, kvia.com. Jason Navarrete, ABC7.